Back in February, when the Sea of Stars demo was released, I made a video on how to reach the brisk hidden market. Well, now that the full game is released, I've tried to go back and do that, but the things have changed. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to actually get to the hidden market in Brisk. So in order to access the hidden market now, you're going to have to do an extra step. Go well, back to the stonemasons outpost because you need to enter you need to enter the mine again and you're gonna to want to go down one floor. Once the elevator stops, go to the right and climb up the ladder. Going through the doorway through this long passageway, you can fight the enemies or ignore them, it doesn't matter. Go to the right again and then strafe across this little ledge get to this other little tunnel with the green crystals continue going right there'll be another little tunnel and another area where you can strafe again there's more enemies you don't have to fight them but you can if you want to then you'll see the big green crystal in the upper right hand part of the room there'll be a ladder behind it climb up the ladder and you'll see a door with a heart shaped hole in it put the mines key in there the door will open you'll climb up and there'll be two green pillars and what you have to do is you have to push one of the pillars down the hole so that you're able to get to the treasure chest below you'll push the first pillar over to the little symbol on the ground when you do that a barrier will rise on the other side then you can push either one of the pillars over to the center and down the hole and a little cutscene will play showing that it falls into the track in the room below just jump down the hole push the pillar up to the top climb up Open the chest, and there's the trader signet. Now, you can go to Brisk and talk to the guy in the hidden market, and he will have those special items for sale. So I'll see you there. Once you arrive at the hidden market, he's going to ask for the trader's signet. You tell him you have it, and that he lets you see the other items. The Eye of Yamara displays weaknesses, resistances, and non-boss enemy HP in combat. The Dubious Dare increases the damage that you take. The Tome of Knowledge increases the XP that you get and the double edge increases damage in certain situations. So those are the secret items you can get. Um, after I was able to get to the hidden market this time, I actually bought the Tome of Knowledge and the Eye of Yamara. I think those would be the most helpful in my playthrough. So this is just a quick video I wanted to update on how to get to the hidden market because I didn't realize that it had changed in the final game. I'm loving Sea of Stars. I have a review coming out pretty soon. And um, I have just really enjoyed this game. And I hope you're enjoying it as well. If you like this video and it helped you, please leave a like. If you didn't, that other button seems to work pretty well too. If you're new here, please consider subscribing for a plethora of gaming-related content, including content on Sea of Stars. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.